Hey everyone, welcome back to MacReact. Today we're gonna to be watching some more Vox Machina for y'all. I know you guys probably remember, but last episode, Pike came through during that card game and she ended up winning the Vestige, which was really cool. But we are still concerned for the group because we know they're not out of hell yet. And, and actually they're about to be attacked by a monster or something. And we don't even know how they're gonna get back to their world. It seemed like they needed Dola to open up the gate, but now Dola's dead. I did see one of you guys suggest maybe Kima will open it since I think Kima uses magic too. But if you guys remember, Kima fell and we still have not seen her yet. So there's a lot to get into in today's episode. We're so excited to watch with y'all. Thank you so much for joining us. Let's do it. Let's do it. We find the Chimera, we slay the Chimera. Simple enough. So we head to the coast. For the thousandth time. Oh. That is where the creature was. Oh, flashback. I know. I was just about to say, are we going to see what happened? You have such a unique rapport. Wonderful. Babysitting again. Yeah, yeah. Just keep up, tight ass. So this is before they were even a thing. Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh. Damn. <gasps> Damn, Kima. No. Oh, okay. I said out of the way. <laughs> oh. Hey, she's doing it though. Nice. Kima. Oh. Okay. Can't keep her down. Yeah, she's tough. I figured she'd be somewhat okay. Anything? Vorigal is still down there. I can sense it. Then what are we waiting for? We can't just charge in against a dragon without a plan. True. And it's just them three? Would you wait if Vexalia was in danger? Would you stand by if Percival's life hung in the balance? That's completely... I mean, she's got him there. Still, you make a fair point. We've always rushed into danger for each other. It would be hypocritical not to in this case. Yep. Fair. But we're not involved, are we? What? No. Then it's not complicated. Damn, he got I mean, you there. Yeah, that's what she said she wanted. Mm-hmm. Why is the gateway so goddamn far? Oh, no. My God, it's huge. Grog, <laughs> chill. Curious. The ice down there looks rather thin. We could use it to our advantage. Be patient. We don't have eyes on the dragon. This is Kima. She doesn't do patience. Without me, she'll put herself in even more danger. She's not taking no for an answer. Damn. He's just making it colder. Oh, by all means. There she is. Got to do something. Okay, we got to do something now. Yeah. Damn it. Oh no. I'm really scared about this. Oh! The hell she muzzled it? Yes! Oh my gosh, wow. dude. She's powerful. She fell again. Okay. Here we go. No. Oh, Kima's taking a beating. No weapon is too goddamn loud. I'm sorry, we can't all blast magic out of our bloody fingers. Oh no. Oh, dude. Oh no, no. Is she good? This hunt is far from over. I don't think those bullets are doing much, bro. I don't think so either. Okay, let's get yeah, weird. he's trying to take him onto the thin ice. Oh, let's get weird. Ooh, oh, that was close. Nice. Wow. There it is. I can start it, but they have to activate it from the other side, or we're stuck. 
think that guy will give us five minutes if we ask real nice? Oh so my maybe gosh. she can do half of it on her end and half of it on their end. Mm -hmm. Someone has to save you from yourself. Really? This again? Why can't you ever trust me? I... I just don't... Look, I don't do this shit because I have a death wish or anything. It's just my way of keeping you out of danger. Aww. <sighs> Not my fourth game, but I'll give it a shot. Nice. Okay. Kima can help. Oh, are you kidding me? Damn. He's going in. Nice. Uh -oh. oh, no. Damn. Time to use that vestige, maybe. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> Dope. What about it? No. What? Oh, that thing's coming too? No. Well, maybe he can fight the dragon. True. Oh. Let's go. <laughs> Let them fight. What is that thing? Hey, you think they're gonna fight or fuck? <laughs> Damn, okay. Oh, this is wild. Oh. Throwing a demon at a dragon. Hell of a plan. That is what we're known for. <laughs> Pike, your hair is... Cram it to roll on. Having a day. <laughs> Cram it. Holy shit. Man, this thing's going to beat a dragon. Oh god, they need to get out of there. Wait, wait, wait. <gasps> oh shit, oh shit. Oh, that was so close. Dude. This show is amazing. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm saying, bro. Five gold on the fire guy. Five gold on the fire guy. <laughs> oh. What a brawl. Oh. What? He Stone Cold stunned him? That was <laughs> <What>? impressive. <laughs> oh. Hey, that was a good fight, though. He weakened it. Yeah. You know me. And you trust me. Can't argue with that. Hey, that's mine. She took oh. the sword. That is Lady Kima of Vord, slayer of beasts, survivor of Emberhold, and the woman I love. Oh, the hype. The hype. Yeah, you're so right. Oh my gosh. Oh. Nice. Oh. Ooh. It's like a hammer and nail. Now some help. Now some help. Oh god. You heard her. Get your team out. Let's go and we have the whole crew. The whole team. He's taking off. Nope. <laughs> what I caught. Hold him down. Ooh, nice. Ready? No, but do it anyway. Damn. Oh, the combo. Yes. Oh, I'm so blown away right now. That's crazy. The teamwork. They need to remember that move. I know.
Then it made a beautiful tree. Yeah. Hey, careful what you chase. You might just catch it. <laughs> <laughs> that was fucking metal. It's what I fell in love with. Come here, tight ass. <laughs> tight ass. <laughs> oh. No. <laughs> Ooh. What would he need those for? Aren't they really tough? Hmm. Oh, he can see if they die. Everyone is against me, but it matters not. They're about to hatch. Is that so? Ripley went there? I have the perfect place in mind. She doesn't mean Whitestone, does she? Oh, God. Laura, can you bamf us out of here? Bamf? Like Nightcrawler? Where? You know, my waterbed homestead, the hot box, the short shack, you know, my, my nightclub. <laughs> Of course, I can't do the trick without a door. So he hasn't been lying about this club place. Entree vu. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. His powers are so what dope. What the fuck is that? Oh. What? <laughs> we didn't get to see it? Well, that was wild. I gotta say, I was not expecting them to kill another dragon. I thought he would get away before. I thought he'd he died. get away. Uh -huh. Yeah, I because I don't know. He's just really tough, and we know how hard it is to take down a dragon. But I don't know. They had Allura. They had Kima there. Well, really, the MVP here was that hell spawn demon thing. Oh yeah, we didn't know we were gonna have that either to weaken the dragon significantly mm -hmm. before we fought it. So that actually was pretty clutch. And they didn't even plan that. It just happened. It was just chasing them. They weren't like, yeah, let's bring this thing because they need help on the other side. Like each side didn't know what was going on exactly. on the other side. Exactly. But it just ended up working out perfectly. perfectly. Yeah. <laughs> Gosh, man. I couldn't even have imagined that better. So yeah, that was a great episode. I also was worried in this episode that we might either seriously injure somebody or somebody might die. So I'm really happy that none of the crew died or anything. I was especially scared about Allura and Kima. I thought one of their asses were gone in this episode. Straight Bro, up. yeah, because we were getting so much backstory and I'm so traumatized by anime by like the moment you see backstory, you're like, oh no, somebody's gonna die. Mm -hmm. So I got really worried. Um, so no, I'm so glad that this episode kind of like revolved around, you know, we're doing crazy things and scary things, but as long as we trust in each other, we're gonna make it out okay. Which I feel like that was kind of the gist of it. So mm -hmm. I'm just happy it all worked out and nobody died. Now I know that we were both a little confused last episode. I oh, think yeah. we probably just heard what we wanted to hear. Are you talking about with Percy and- With Percy mm -hmm. and Vexalia, yeah. They were talking about how they know that there's something between the two of them. And Percy kind of made it seem like, yeah, I do want more. But Vex kind of shut it down and was like, no, we can't be anything more than a fling. Yeah. Because look at what's happening between Kima and Alora. I right definitely now. heard the opposite. But I think I was just, I was excited they were finally having the conversation. And so I thought it was going to work out because they're so obviously like perfect for each other. And so. I thought I kind of heard what I wanted to hear because I thought that they were a mirror of what Keyleth and Vax were going through. Yeah. Kind of like, we can't be together for this reason, that reason. I thought the other two would come to the opposite conclusion. Like, oh, actually we should be together because you never know, any day might be our last day. So we might as well spend it with the person we care about the but most. But we were wrong. No, they 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 <sighs> shut it down and basically said like, no, this, this can't go any further than just being a fling. But I think um, in this episode, they kind of both realized. That's what I was going to say. Yep. They kind of both realized that even if they don't put a label on it, if it came down to it, they would risk it like their own life to save the other. And I think that says a lot to like, you know, if you're willing to risk your life and everything for one person and 
maybe a title is a stupid thing to worry about, you know? Like just be happy with that person and know that like y'all are fighting for each other together and you know, you're gonna make it through as long as you trust in each other. So I don't know, I think they're worried about the same thing that Vax and Keyleth are. Like one of them passing and then the other one being heartbroken. Mm -hmm. But like we said earlier, you know, I mean, if you're willing to die for them, you might as well just live with them too. Better to love and lose than never have loved at all. Exactly. You know? All right, guys, this is definitely an insane episode. If you enjoyed our reaction, make sure you leave a like and subscribe because it definitely helps out our channel. And make sure you follow our Instagram for some extra content from us. But as always, you guys are the greatest, and we'll catch you in the next one. Peace out, guys. Bye.